Yo, my Gwen Bobby Chin is that guy. Not locks. This is not nation. You guys are not nationers. And what we do here on this channel is we dig in, dissect, and review dreadlock journeys of the world. We share and participate in dreadlock and cultured live streams of the cannabis. Well, basically, kind of having a good time, chilling, smoking, dreading, being naughty. And if you want to become a part of the nation, just hit that subscribe button down below. We are growing and we are doing another video today. Being Thousand Band Fawny requested over and over. Apparently, people think I've been sleeping on it. Sleeping. But I'm not asleep, brethren. I'm awake and alive. And we're going to do this ting right now for Guan Like Fire. So we're going to get right into this. Let's go. You know when uh, we do these dread reviews, we're always in participation with um, no sponsors. <laughs> this is uh, there's ads on the videos, but there's no paid sponsorships in these videos, not yet, anyways. But if you would like to be featured on the channel, be featured on the Instagram, just let me know in the comments below. Normally I say add me to your featured section on your channel and I'll subscribe to you and do a dread review on your locks especially. But with today being the day it is, we're looking at a thousand band following. Let's go right into this video. Who is this guy and why does Playboy Cardi pop up? It must be his brethren. In the likes of my eyes, this must be Fawny right here. Sorry if I'm mis misrepresenting his name. Cardi. Cardi, we know Cardi with the free form high top. Now his boy Fonny here looking like he got a high top guaning too. And you know, the thing about the millennials these days is they feel that the high top dread is the most popular way to dread. Probably because having this little bit hair trimmed up makes you feel like your hair is neat. Let's say that. His hair is short. Very short. Only down to his eyebrow in some of these pictures. Only down to the eyebrows. Toting these guns. Banging them. Uh, a little bit of length gained here. The shape of his locks, they kind of look like scraggly, like a little freeform-esque. Like, I'm um, trying to figure it out as we go here. I'm not exactly sure how his style has come about. Repping him on Twitter, 44,000. If I can only see here his photos. We can see that he's got some length now. Mad thinny and skinny dreads here. Some of these have congoed up. Always a good sign to see that dreadlock strength congoing up. His hair goes back and not in front of his face so much. Sides being tapered quite a bit. Backwards in blunt in mouth. Some of these locks looking pretty deformed. Unnaturally unsymmetrical. So uh, good to see that he has let some congoing take place. I am digging the artist look these days with the paint on the pants and shit like that. Like, I feel like that's a cool look. I want to start rocking that a bit more. This was the shot that I was interested in. Not only is he doing it in the front and side taper, but the back as well. This probably being quite the refreshing hairdo in the summertime. Let the heat off your neck. Cooling down the nape. Ay, I missed. I missed. Uh, hair, his hair is braided up, fish boned up, dreads hanging, real nice, cool set of locks. They definitely actually look freeformed in my opinion. You can just see some frizzy hairs and little loose spots happening. So don't be afraid to freeform your locks. They can still look pretty good. They can still look pretty neat. In this photo, they definitely look quite mature and quite solid in the dread itself. Here we go. With his locks here. They actually kind of look poofy in this picture. Dread gang. Everybody's got the dreads. I love that everyone's rocking dreads these days. The millennials, man. I'm telling you. Let's get all of them in the nation. You know, so there's actually not too many pictures on this dude. Can't find a whole lot on his dread game. But it is existence. And maybe if I just um, go on Instagram here. Maybe someone has found some tags of this guy and this one pops up. 
which is a kind of a horrific photo in my opinion. If and how this is thousand band Fawny, his dreads are in bad shape. Like, this looks like thinning. Not much locks going on at the top here. Like, is it just me or does it look awkward? I don't know. Dreads can look awkward and this is the most awkward picture I've seen on him thus far. So I'm not really sure what was happening in that picture there. And it's like, I'm not really sure why other pictures are popping up that aren't him. We've got a Facebook page here. Short dreads, short hair. Damn, Shan. This cat has no social media presence. And then we pull up a video of him. Let's see how he does here. First time experiencing Thousand Band Fawny. Some auto tune, sipping lean, smoking weed music. Yo, but his locks look dope. His locks look actually pretty dope in this video. Oh, son of a. Son of a gun! Yeah, his, his locks actually look like they've been um, Bantu knot up. Bantu knotted or something at this point. I don't know what's going on in there. Yeah, definitely Bantu'd up. He's only got 1,000 followers. 8,000. A little bit better than the last one. A little bit better. Uh, what do you guys think of his music? Interesting to know enough. His locks look better in the videos than they do in the photos I pulled up. No doubt about it. Checking out one more video here. Sounds a little bit better. So he's actually got some versat versatility in his flow. Yeah, so he's definitely got some versatility. Maybe check out his music more. His freeform locks actually looking pretty dope. So it's cool to see where his locks are going in the years to come. Hopefully he keeps them. Maybe he's going to color them up, braid them up. I don't know. But um, I definitely hope you guys enjoyed this video. Ending it here for now. Um, but hopefully you guys are appreciative of the video now that has been done finally and definitely stay tuned for more dread reviews in the future I got a vlog channel where we do daily vlogs uh, inline skating is a topic adventures are the topic drones are the topic and I also do like um, Vloggy type days, so uh, definitely hit me up over there uh, Links in the description and I will definitely see you guys soon soon man peace out one love thanks for watching brothers and sisters i'm gone adios wagwan